All right, we're back here scanning the 300 still. Um, we've just taken the front bar off. We thought some people might like to see what's significantly different from the 200 series. Um, 200 series is, uh, what, came out in 2007. What does that make it? 14 years old now. So um, a big evolution change. So we've got uh, heat exchangers at the front here, are probably the biggest thing. So uh, hot V, um, turbo diesel V6. So it's got a watered air uh, intercooling system at the back. So these are the heat exchangers at the front. They're joined together, they run the same coolant by the looks of it. Uh, it's got the a split reservoir in there. A uh, little, um, so bull bar designers are obviously gonna have to work around this. It looks pretty integrated. I don't know um, how many people are gonna try and move them. So I'd expect you're gonna see bull bar designers try to retain the ducting as much as possible um, and keep them in their factory position. There is a little electric water pump that lives just under the wheel arch here, so which runs them both, they're joined together and the intercooler is on the back of the engine, the V6, so right at the very back. Um, interestingly, some other changes, there's um, crash structure here that wasn't present on the 200, which is also behind the wheel. Um, so they're obviously trying to do something in terms of a, an impact down the, the side of the vehicle. It's on both sides as well. Um, yeah, and further than that, I mean, it's still pretty much a conventional car. You know, the principal, the headlights, you know, the bumper. Um, what is nice though for fitting a bull bar is Almost always the wiring connections and the plugs live under here inside the wheel arch line. You've got to get your arms in. Um, for this car, they just poke them over the top. They just sit on top here. So you can see them in the bar here. Um, if you go to take the bar, the bar off, you can just disconnect them very easily. So very thoughtful of Toyota. Um, absolutely brilliant wiring, um, routing and management, cable management through here. So uh, as you'd expect. Um, but it is, it is definitely yeah, a bit of a step up on the 200 everywhere. So. We're, ripping, we're scanning it now. We'll have um, data available for frontal protection system development pretty soon. Uh, give us a call if you need any data or if you want to um, get in the line for testing next year. Thanks.